Just remember, guys, that most people are just trying to win or um, just look like the coolest person in the room. It's nothing personal. That's just how most people think. Most people aren't, you know, most people are just trying to get things out of a situation, you know, and this could be like a work situation, um, friends, family, whatever, you know, some, there's some people that are just like wired like that. And I guess I had to go through it to where when you see, you can eventually see like where people are coming from, like through their actions, like like they, though they may act friendly towards you, they aren't actually your friends. You know, they're not actually like looking out for you, you know, as much as they can. And from my, uh, you know, it took me a while to get to that because, you know, I always, for me, I always just thought people, uh, thought the same way I thought. And I think a lot of us go through this where we think we, uh, we just assume people are thinking how we think, but that's not the case. Like some people just don't care about other people, you know? And it's not like they wouldn't help you if you really needed help. Some definitely wouldn't, but it's just the fact that like your like thoughts, opinions, and emotions like hold zero value to uh to what they think. And which is fine, but it's it's just important to realize that. Because if you don't, you'll just be getting taken advantage of, you know? And, yeah, it's just a, just, it's just a nice realization to have. And it brings me to another point, like, you know, always be aware of what is going on around you, like how people see you where they're coming from, like, like what level they're on, like what is important to the people around you? Like, and it's pretty easy to see, like, what do they do like every day? You know, like what level is their like ambition at? Like, you know, do they drink? Do they do drugs? Like you just gotta like kind of categorize people and then you're like, oh, this person lives this lifestyle and this is how they think. And you could just have a conversation with them or two. And, you know, because you could always look, oh, they're in this position, but they're trying to, they have the same goals I have. You know, they're trying to be spiritually advanced. They're trying to, you know, let go of like negative qualities of themselves. Like it it's a tough lesson to learn, but most people like aren't trying to get rid of their negative qualities. They're trying to like, in some regards, they're trying to exasperate it to help them get through, you know, to help them achieve their accomplishments, you know, whether it's be more deceptive to, uh, you know, in business, persuasive, whatever it may be, you know, you'll be able to pick up on how these, how people around you are acting. And the more you can like cultivate awareness, like the less you'll be manipulated. Cause you have to realize people are only coming from the place from which they're at. Like, You can have all the knowledge in the world and, you know, it, you'll have a really good idea, 
like you'll tell somebody that's not at that like level of knowledge of what you're speaking of and they'll just think it's stupid or like it doesn't make sense to them in the same token like everybody has different levels of knowledge like there's plenty of people around me that have knowledge in areas uh that I don't have knowledge in and it's like you know for me to like judge on their areas of knowledge you know I would be like oh you know you're good at this let me hear what you have to say but you'll realize that I don't think people for the most part at least people that I've ran into out and about like people have a tough time humbling themselves and like, like giving people their dues of like that they have a little more knowledge in a certain subject. It's, it's kind of ridiculous that like, you know, it's like the people that like, okay, you know, you hire a plumber to fix a leak under the sink but like the whole time he's there you're just like telling him like oh you're doing it wrong why are you doing it like that it's like it's honestly kind of comical that the people around you that that a lot of people are just like that like they just want to like know that they are better or like want to be the one that like oh, I'm the one who knows the most in this situation. Like, it seems like there's a lot of people that do that, and there's a lot of people that don't, but it's just interesting to see. Because at first you may, like, second-guess yourself. But then you have to realize, oh, these people just aren't humble. Like, they're, they aren't... They're just, uh... They'll just say anything to look good. Or to, like, look, uh, they want to look like they have all the answers. Like, no lie, like, the people around me, like, I'll read about things for, like, years and years. But, like, the fact that, like, and I'll, like, speak on this and they'll just be, like, just point blank, like, nah that ain't right like okay i'm not saying you have to agree with me but at the same time it's like how many hours have you like read into this none oh and you're you're uh telling me that i don't know what i'm talking about when uh when you have zero knowledge zero time put in to uh what i'm speaking on Okay. So. So what is that? Like. Yeah, that's. It's like what an in insane person. That's how an insane person would act. Like a non-rational person. It's just. Uh, just interesting to see how people act. And, yeah, but yeah, guys, the whole reason I brought this up is just be aware, you know, like, at the same time, it's just best not to speak to people on, like, you know, whether it's your dreams or, like, whatever it may be just best to keep it to yourself because you know a lot of people they either won't understand it they're not really supportive of that for you they want you to be how they they think you should be instead of like you know like how you actually are and like so just be aware guys <clears throat>